Hello, how are you? Sarah Travers from Bespoke Communications here with a message on how I can help you fall in love with the next presentation that you give, even if you're dreading it. Now, good communication skills are fundamental, they're essential to good business. Now, there's no avoiding doing presentations, whether you're in the public, whether you're in the private or the voluntary sector, good communication underpins the very culture of an organisation. Internally, good communication skills keep staff informed and engaged and feeling valued. And externally, well, they do the same for clients, for customers, for stakeholders. So if you've got a presentation coming up, maybe you're speaking at a conference on a panel, maybe you're taking part in the making of a company video, you're appearing in a podcast, or even making an appearance on the local news. How can you make sure that you are connecting with the audience that's watching or listening, whoever they are, and getting your message heard? So this is what we at Bespoke Communications do on a daily basis, working with individuals and organizations to help them have those important and sometimes difficult conversations to change hearts and minds and even behaviors, or simply to educate inform or even entertain and what we found is that with all the best presenters that we work with the secret of the best presentations always lies in the presenter's storytelling ability now a week after a presentation the science says we remember the stories not necessarily the facts and figures we remember the aha moment we remember the big revelation and it underpins the why of the presentation, whether it's the story of the first customer, why the organization was set up, if it's a charity, you know, why it was founded and the difference that it makes to people on the ground. Maybe it's your story of a triumph over adversity or, uh, you know, maybe it's that member of staff who really went the extra mile this month. So obviously it, is the story has to be appropriate to the presentation and to the audience and it must be authentic and it must come from the heart with energy. Flip side of that is in most of our training courses, we find that the storytelling side of things is what people find the hardest to do. Why? Because it requires us to be vulnerable. It requires us to share perhaps times when we had to overcome a challenge, perhaps things didn't go so well, Perhaps it's an emotional or difficult story to tell. Other times it's our mindset. We, we literally think, why would anybody be interested in my story? Or maybe somebody else has given you a story to tell and it's not really coming from the heart. It's awkward in the telling. So two tips for you today. The first tip to overcome that storytelling eek uh, that we can feel at times is to change how you view the story. Fall in love with the story that you're going to tell. Don't allow your brain to overthink who cares about this or am I oversharing and absolutely pour your heart and your soul into it. Don't throw it away because when you love the presentation you give, you add energy and even a touch of magic to the talk. So the second tip is spend time on the story. It's really important that you stay there for a while, even if it is a little bit uncomfortable, because that is where you're making the impact. It's like when you, you hear your favorite song on the radio and maybe you're in the car and you know, it just has that mood changing feeling because you've heard something and it, and it just appeals to something inside you. Well, that's what your story does. So don't waste the opportunity. And every story that you tell is also an opportunity to make a point. So you've fallen in love with your story, you spend a bit of time there, you're thinking now, I've told that story, what do I want my audience to feel? What do they need to learn? And what do they need to do as a result of hearing this story? So you're not just saying it for the sake of it, it has to pass the so what test. And now what test? So I've told you this story, it really affected me, I feel that you could learn from it. And, and that really is the, the most powerful story that you can tell. If you would like to find out more about how Bespoke Communications could help you and your storytelling, then please do get in touch. And for those of you who are delivering online presentations and wondering, is there anybody out there? We have a brand new course for you called Amazing Online Presentations. 
why don't you check it out? <laughs>